Hi everyone, I'm Lisa Brown with Sway Ballroom Dance and today we are going to talk about arm styling for Viennese walls. One of the biggest mistakes I see in Viennese walls is that people are not uh, comfortable taking enough space on the floor. They want to keep their arms down and small. So what we're going to do today is practice making our arms wide and taking up space. So the sequence we're going to work with is to get side, balance, side, balance, we're going to turn and then open up the arms. So again, we're going to go side, balance, side, balance, turn and open up. So the things I'm thinking about is that my elbows are always staying parallel to the floor. I'm never dropping them below horizontal because that's going to make me look small. The eye line is going to bring my ar the arms down and that's not going to make me look as big. So I want big wide arms. So with my elbows wide, I'm going to lead with my elbows, keeping them high and sweeping the fingers to follow. Then when I turn, I'm going to keep the elbows high and from this position, I'm going to lead my elbow out, up and over to create an arc over my head. So when I turn the other way, keeping my elbows high and then from here, leading with my elbow to do a big arc up and over my face. So if I go this direction, we're going to go wall side, side, turn, big arc, leading with the elbows, side, side, turn, big arc. The other thing when you're doing your arm movements is you want to impulse the beginning part of the movement. So if I do an arc, I'm not going to keep a consistent timing of the arc. I'm going to impulse the beginning. Impulse, then extend. If I turn, I'm going to impulse, then extend. Impulse, extend. Impulse, extend. And that should help you make your arms bigger and more, have more impact when you're dancing the Viennese waltz. And that's it.